Tyler Berger, a little piece of history, four-time low national All-American and low national champ, two times. You join an uh, elite group: uh, Morgan McIntosh, Joey Davis, Jason Zertzis, and now you, Sam Crevis. Sam, <laughs> Sam Crevis. Yeah. So you guys are a pretty, pretty elite company. But uh, you know, looking at that, first off, Longo's tough. Have you guys butted heads? You're both West Coast guys. Uh, once last year. He's a big physical kid, man. He's got some arms and legs on him. Uh, that's the kind of body type I had to get used to. Get, I had to tread this specifically for him. Um, that's something we don't run into every day, so I uh, kind of had to change up my style a little bit, but it ended up working out. Where's your mullet? My mullet? <laughs> uh, I live in a small town. I was going to do it for the year, but uh, my girlfriend didn't want that. So. All the guys had it at the <laughs> Oregon State camp. Oh, yeah. That's uh, definitely an Oregon thing, especially where I'm from. But... Not me. <laughs> Crook County Cowboys, you guys broke some history team-wise this year. I think you had the most placers, yeah. most points in Oregon history. Mm -hmm. First off, how is, is your state getting better as a whole state? Um, comparing it to when I was a freshman, I don't know if it's getting better, but we definitely have some individuals that are real tough and compete at the national level. But uh, I think a lot of that talent is right there in uh, Crook County, in the Crook County Wrestling Room. And that's why I changed schools this year. Um, best room in the state, best coaches, best athletes. And it's just a great community, loves wrestling, and it's supported me since day one. You don't plan on working at Les Schwab, do you? No, plan on going to Nebraska and winning the national title. Why Nebraska? Of all the places you could go, you could have stayed home, could have gone to Corvallis. Why Nebraska? Uh, first of all, Big Ten. You're not going to get any better competition than the Big Ten. Uh, I've watched Nebraska since I was little. I've watched Jordan Burroughs. Now Sam Green, Jake Sufo, and all those guys look up to him. Uh, just tough, tougher than nails. I've seen how they how they plan to get to the NCAAs, how they build their athletes up, and I loved it. I loved the environment, and I thought it was the best place for me. Looking at Lincoln, Nebraska, it's one of the all-time great college towns. Is that something that draws you to a place too? You know, you know, you can go there. You can, you know, have an actual life too. Exa yeah, that's exactly. You want to. I made the, the commitment to go to Nebraska, not as a four or five year commitment, but as an eight, ten year commitment. Uh, I want to finish college and uh, plan on wrestling in the Olympics, world championships, why I'm going to be the best in the world, and I think that's why I picked Nebraska. I think I can do that. 49 or 57? Uh, depends on how big I get in the summer. How big what, are, they want. what are you right now? Uh, about 60, so I mean, I'd be a, probably a 49 pounder right now, how I'm, how I'm weighing, I get a little bit bigger. Looking at the training partners out there, obviously Souflon Green, Jason Chamberlain, obviously Jordan Burroughs. Oh yeah. But uh, having those guys, how much better do you think you can get? I think I can compete on a on a world level once I uh, once they get through with me, they uh, train me, build me up. Um, that's I mean that's my ultimate goal, and that's that's uh, what I think they can get me to. What did Coach Snyder say? I saw him here. You guys give you a little handshake afterwards. Yeah. What did he say? He said good job. Uh, kind of gave me a little pep talk about. Uh, some of the matches talked about the Jason Olf match and Dapper Dan, uh, a little bit of pointers, but uh, yeah, it's just uh, just having some good conversation. As a last hurrah in Oregon, could we see a mullet? <laughs> yeah, I can try to build, get, grow one out in a little bit. You might see it next year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you got anything else for me? Uh, I just want to thank the Lord uh, for what He's done for me this last four years. Uh, one of my, it's going to be my last collegiate tournament uh, through high school, and uh, you can't, you can't think you do. <laughs> oh, Willie! Willie, yeah, Willie, yeah, Willie so, I want to thank Willie, Willie too. Willie's so happy right now. <laughs> but uh, to think you can get through something like this all by yourself, it's, uh, I mean, you can't, you can't do it. So I, I, the Lord's been with me every day, every step of the way, and I, and I love him, and he loves me. All right, Tyler, congratulations. Good luck in Lincoln. Uh, thank you.